Good morning, everybody, and this is your Dow Jones day trade setups for today. So, a couple of things. We are sort of hovering down here on structure. Uh, do we have a level down here at uh, let's get it uh, 33134? Uh, nothing really going on, to be quite honest. Uh, this range that we spoke about yesterday has broken, but we also did try to find some support there as well. So, there are buyers coming in for some reason here. Uh, nobody's really just selling so we are waiting for the politicians and we're just hovering around while we wait for the politicians seems to be the nature of the beast at the moment um, most of the year has been like that we get into an area and we just hover around if you look to the left anyway so we do have a crossover of the moving averages but we do have a grouping of the oscillators to the downside so um, you know your guess is as good as mine at the moment I think it's probably safer to trade this as a range right now. This does look like we are setting up or trying to set up some structure, but we are not on a level. We've closed below the, the nearest level. So let's get to the hour just to see if that changes. Uh, it does change a little bit. Let's pull that down to there. And uh, that still doesn't give us any structure that I trust. So what I'm talking about is these two bars here that have closed on the level. Well, one's closed on the level, one closest above it. But that there is not a retest of the level. This big tail here is a test of the level. But I would have wanted to see an inside bar or an engulfing bar on the second bar. So that hasn't happened. So this could be a situation of breaking down we are below the moving averages uh, but we do have diversions here and that's bullish diversion so could be bottom of range or it could be just drifting lower so um, more than likely it's going to drift about while we wait for politicians and as i said yesterday unfortunately they've got the whole month to sort their nonsense out still so if you look at the 15 minutes starting to group back the upside here um, no real structure if you look to the left on my cursor, you can see you know, that area there was not really structure. It was rejections, lots of tails, but uh, wasn't structure off a level that uh, I would have wanted to, to trade off. So anyway, leaving it alone yesterday was the right decision. It has dropped though, and now what we're looking for is if we get a, a pullback to 33.225, definitely an opportunity to short off there. And then I'm just going to use this level up here, bring it down. And that where we are now is the other op option that we do have. Just bear in mind that this bottom level here at 33091 is a fairly strong area of support. So anything can happen here. But I think um, we need to wait for politicians, to be honest. I don't think you're going to get anything else. But it's probably going to follow the trend of yesterday, which was just to drift lower. So a drift low during the European session, bounce a little bit, and then again during the US session. So I think that pretty much more the same that we should expect today. Anyway, those are levels. Uh, 33.225, looking for a rejection of that, or we're looking for a rejection where we are now. But I'd be a little bit cautious about this one because of the strong area of support below. Anyway, that's it for me. Hope it helps, and uh, we'll catch up with you tomorrow. Cheers for now.